Hello there and welcome again to Retro PC Refurbs. Today is the last in the LGA 1150 series with the i7-4790. This has a 4 core and 8 threads with a clock speed of 3.6 GHz and a turbo of 4 GHz. This is still very capable of playing modern titles at 60 plus FPS. Here the 8 GB of RAM held the FPS back. I have lost some footage of the chip and have now sold it on, so I cannot re-record it. I've also lost Sons of the Forest. So without further ado, here are the games. You guys were in bed with fish all along? Oh, no, I'll never get that image out of my head. Get out! Take him out! So your plan didn't work. On to plan B, getting kicked in the face. As I reconfigure them, you better not try to sell them off. Not like I'd make any money. Things are so Nora? up here, Peter. Hey.
to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. The conclusion, you will be fine for another few years with this chip. I would suggest 16 gigabytes to take full advantage of the chip. This board only has two slots and damned if I'm going to pay for two 8 gigabyte sticks unless anyone would like to donate some. There is the K version that you could overclock to get a few more frames out of it. In a few more years, these four core chips will start to struggle even more with newer games as these will and are demanding more cores to hit the 60 plus magic frames. 